Hello, this is Breuer, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Football Manager 2019. We are in the month of February here, and uh, next game up is against Cheltenham here. Uh, with a follow-up game against Hull in the Checker Trade uh, Northern Section Semi-Final. Um, but yeah, I mean, things have been going okay since the last episode you guys saw. The last episode you guys saw was Man United and Lincoln. Uh, we actually put up a pretty good goal scoring outing against Lincoln here in the checker trade round. Then we went on a goal scoring clinic against Morikam. Lost to Rockdale zero to one, which is just a tough game. I will say this was the first game without Ash as our goalkeeper. He actually got injured before the game, uh, so we weren't going to be able to play him anyway. But we, we did go ahead and transfer him out. <laughs> Very scary. Maybe a bad thing to do. Uh, I'm really hoping we can hold on for the rest of the games which I guess these next two games here, 3 to 2, 42, do show that we are starting to give up, you know, some multi-goals here, but our offense is also holding on. So, you know, overall, pretty good outing uh, with our really backup, backup, backup goalkeeper. Like, just, we have, like, basically no goalkeeper right now. Um, but, so we're really relying on the offense to go out there and just outscore the, the defense, or out outscore the other team, I should say. Uh, I will say, though, we have brought in where are they at we've got a lot of players here we brought in a couple free transfers just because they're young and possibly could turn into something but we did grab in uh this jackson smith guy as a goalkeeper we got him in on a loan so i'm hoping we can play him and we've also got a couple other guys on loans that should be coming up soon they won't be able to start until uh next season however so we've got at least two other goalkeepers for next season and hopefully this guy here can see us through to the end of the season currently uh we shall see uh, if that is the case, but you know, overall playing well, offense is playing awesome. Uh, speaking of offense, let's go look at something real quick. Uh, not that squad. If we go look at our, um, maybe just reports. No, what am I looking for? Stats. Um, not general clay. Maybe just goal attempts. Yeah, there we go. So overall, we've got a lot of players that are in the double digits for goals. We got Yates at 10, Lloyd at 10, Rooney at 11, Cool at 11, and Matthews at 13. Uh, Tomlinson and Williams are coming up close behind. Randall at 6. We've got several people with goals. I and mean, we've got goals all the way coming down to McFarland down here at 1. So it's it's a lot of good goal scoring all around. It's actually been a long time since Rooney's last goal, uh, to be fair. Uh, Williams has been a little while, but he actually had three goals in the game that he had last. So he's played well when he's played, you know, when he's been out there. Um, but overall, not not half bad. Uh, been some good, good play from the team overall. But yeah, let's go ahead and just get to the game. Let's, let's see what we can do here. Um, all right, so we're going to go ahead and keep Rooney in here. We do have a promise to play Rooney at the moment. So we're going to go ahead and keep him in here to hopefully, you know, hopefully he plays well for us. Uh, we also have a promise to Gaffney. Let's go ahead and pull Gaffney in here just, just because. We'll bring Lloyd back in here. Uh, Matthews, Thomason, Worthington. Those are our trio here in the middle. And I think I am pretty happy with that. Halliday on the right side. We actually have Reed as a promise as well. And I'm okay with that. I mean, honestly, I'm okay. These are all good players. So I'm not, I'm not up, you know, I uh, feel like I'm risking anything to play these good players. Doyle's still injured, isn't he? How much longer? Six days. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and keep playing Toure for now. Uh, and then we've got Smith, our loaned player, here in uh, the goalkeeper role. So hopefully that um, hopefully does something for us. I mean, he's not great as a uh, sweeper keeper. Uh, he can play pretty well as a goalkeeper, but I think we'll leave him as a sweeper keeper. He'll be all right, I'm pretty sure. Um, and then let's make sure we have some good players here otherwise on our bench. Let's bring Platt in here. Um... Let's bring Holiday back in here somewhere. Actually, I'll we'll bring Holiday in for. There we go. Let's we'll do that. Austin Platt Holiday. I think that's going to be okay. Um, what else we got going on? Probably want a different midfielder. We got Nabby, and let's bring on maybe Bird. Williams as an ups, uh, alternate. Uh, actually, we'll go with. Uh, where is he at? Hardy as an alternate. And then Yates up front. And I think that'll work just fine. 
All right, feels pretty good. Um, it's going to be a game against, I think they're, what, 12th ranked at Cheltenham? I guess we'll see here in a moment. Oh, yeah, squad number needs to be given out to our lone player. Number one. I like that. I'll give him a number one. Hopefully he plays really well for us. Really, really need to get some good play from our goalkeeper here. Uh, yeah, just pick up where you left off, guys. Looks like, uh, who is that? Callum seems pretty motivated by that. That feels pretty good. Let's pause for just a second. Let's bring this back to extended highlights. And slow it down just a smidge. All right, there we go. And we're off. Should just be an opening highlight here. I'm not expecting much from this highlight. In fact, it looks like it's about to fade out. Oh, maybe not. Lloyd going to get over to Worthington. Worthington going to get it back over to Torre on the left-hand side. Torre tried to get inside. It's going to be a throw in here. I'm expecting this into that highlight. Or not. We're actually going to get something here. Oh, there we go. I was going to say. There we go. Cheltenham is actually currently in fifth place. So, it's going to be a tough game. We're in second. We got a 25-point goal diff. The only team that's actually ahead of us, uh, besides Stevenage, is Cheltenham. So they they have a strong offense. We, we would have to expect this to be a, a pretty, pretty decent game. It's going to be raining, obviously, you can see. So uh, that can, can change things quite a bit. Reed getting the ball here. Gets it over to Matthews in the middle. Matthew, Matthews has a chance to set up for a goal. <laughs> 14th goal of the season. He is our goal leader this season. Matthews just playing outstanding from that midfield role. Um... Just absolutely incredible play from him. I'm very, very happy to have him on the team. Good stuff. Gets us within striking distance of Stevenage, which is which is good. Uh, I mean, honestly, though, at this point, I mean, it'd, it'd be great to win the league. But I would be happy to get the auto promotion just so we don't have to go through the playoffs with our maybe not necessarily great goalkeeper status, you know. So we'll see what we can do. We'll see if we can hold on here. Looks like they're playing with more discipline. Fair enough. Man, they've got a really good goal diff. It's insane. All right, throw in here from Cheltenham just before the half. Come on, guys. Hold on for just a little bit longer. Do not want to give up a goal here right before halftime. Come on, guys. Get in front of this. Get in front of this, guys. Oh, my goodness. What an incredible goal from George Lloyd here. Just, just rocketed into the back of the net. I mean, I had a feeling that was coming, but the guys just couldn't get in front of it in time, I guess, or something. I don't know. We've had seven shots, two on target, so we have definitely been dominating the offensive side, but unfortunately the goal uh, the, the goal scoring, uh, we're currently being tied right now. I can't talk all of a sudden. Uh, is, is really the most important stat here. So, yeah, let's just keep it up, guys. Go out there and express yourself, guys. Come on. Come on. We got this. We got this. We're, we're playing better than them, but, you know, we've given up the one shot we've given up is a goal. So, come on. Let's keep it up. Got a corner kick here from uh, Cheltenham. Gets it inside. Uh, okay, good. I, thought, I was like, nobody really is really moving. I'm hoping that that was uh, not going to go in the back of the net. Got eight shots, two on target. Oh, Gaffney getting tripped up there. Thomas is trying to come over to pick that one up. Unfortunately, not able to get to it. Uh, easy, going to be easy goal attempt for Andrews here, and he does get it into the back of the net. Come on, guys, that is not, that is not acceptable. We need to see better play than that. We should be winning, beating this, this team. This is our our home game. Um, we should be beating this team. Come on, Thomas, show me what you got. Oh, thought man, <laughs> Burge had to get down to his knees. You know, it was a pretty good strong kick there. So we had a we had a chance for that one to go in. We've seen him uh, make him from that that point as uh, before. Who is playing poorly? Looks like Gaffney playing terribly right now. We gave him a chance, not really doing what we need him to do. Let's bring Hardy on. Come on, guys. Come on. All right, corner kick here from Tomlinson. Gets it inside. Rooney's in the area. Had a chance there. Unfortunately, nothing going. Matthew's going to be able to run this one down. He's going to be able to get another attempt here. Nope, it's just going to be an out of bounds. It's going to be a throw in here. I'm not sure if we're going to get a highlight here or not. We are not going to get a highlight there. Um, a couple of our guys just really are not playing well, are they? Lloyd actually not playing too well at the moment. Hmm. Bring somebody on for Kelleher, maybe. Let's bring Platt on. Come on, guys. We gotta get this one back. 
Let's go ahead and move it up to more of attacking mentality. A lot of shots for on target. We can't can't seem to buy a goal all of a sudden. All right. Um, last sub of the game. Really, just nobody playing exceptionally well. Let's do something for Lloyd here. I guess we'll bring Yates on for Lloyd just to change some things up a little bit. Come on, guys. Come on, we need this one. It's a home game. It's going to be a free kick here from Cheltenham. Okay, thankfully, that one is out of bounds. Not a lot of time left here, though, unfortunately. I guess we'll go very attacking. What else have we got to lose? Throw in here from uh, Simple. Simple gets it into Ture. Ture gets it over to Worthington in the middle. Worthington gets it up to... Oh, I thought... Uh, I was hoping he would run up there and be able to do something with that. Unfortunately, just a little too far. Burge is able to come out for that one. Worthington able to get his head on that one. Unfortunately, only as far as the Cheltenham player. Back to Stewart. Stewart kicks it deep. Uh, Andrews is in the area. Over to Lloyd. Lloyd has another chance here. Over the net. It's not a lot of time here to get this from drawn back up. Really not a lot of time here. They're throwing here from Cheltenham. Come on, guys. Right, we're going to get in front of that one. Matthew's kicking it pretty deep up. Unfortunately, we're not going to be able to run this one down because Rooney is just not fast, unfortunately. Maybe we should have swapped Rooney over somewhere else and put Yates up there. I don't know. Kick back to their goalkeeper. Goalkeeper's probably going to kick it pretty deep here, I expect. Yes, there it goes. We're able to get collect that one. Platt gets tripped up, though, immediately. Up to Andrews. Andrews going to be able to just get a free kick on this one. Uh, we're able to clear that one out. Simple was able to run that one down. We are going to get a free kick here from Tansy. Tansy gets it over to... Platt was able to get his head on that one. It is going to be a corner kick. Running out of time. The seconds are ticking away. Thomas... That'll be another corner kick. Literally just moments left, unfortunately, in this game. Another highlight. I'm expecting this to be the last highlight of the game, so I don't expect this to actually be a goal attempt from us, unfortunately. Matthew's going to get uh, called here for something, probably. Oh, uh, looks like they're saying he's wasting time. He's faking the injuries. <laughs> That's what they just said. Wow. Wow, he's just writhing there. He's just in so much pain. Oh, but he's good. He's good. No, okay. All that pain, man. He was in so much pain there. As you can tell as he's walking off, the amount of... Like, I think his leg is basically hanging off by, like, you know, just a little little bit of skin there. I don't think he had much skin left. Not much, much. And his bone was broken through, clean through on that one. Ah. Well, well, well. I am not happy with the performance of other guys. Come on. Can't be losing those types of games. That drops us down. Oh, we're still second place. But puts a much bigger gap between us and Stevenage if we wanted to try and win this league. I mean, honestly, maybe that's too hopeful. Uh, I think just getting automatic promotion is just a huge, huge victory for us. But, man, you hate to hate to lose them like that. Well, we got so many goals. I mean, look at it, so many more shots. Better possession. Just couldn't couldn't see it through. Definitely Matthews, you know, the only kind of highlight of the of the the game itself, really. All right, we got an away game against Hull City. We're probably going to swap back to our underdog formation, if you will. So we'll go with that. Got a forward here. I mean, has potential, but pretty expensive. I don't think we want this guy. And we'll say acknowledge just so we can kind of keep him in our our, our uh, kind of list. Just you never know, but I doubt it that we'll be going after that guy. Post match analysis. It's not really a good game. Gavin just not playing well. Stevenage is our game after the whole city game. <laughs> I mean, that'd be one way to get some points back against Stevenage. So, who knows? We'll see what we can do. Uh, under 18s won their game. Good to see. But they've been playing really, really well this season. Little well, scouting report. I guess Liverpool got uh, the Carabao Cup. Good for them. 
All right, what do we got here? Training advice. Go ahead and select those. This is a midfielder, young midfielder, has some potential. Yeah, I mean, has definitely has some potential. I'm kind of tempted to just keep signing some of these youngsters and just go with it. I mean, they're not going to cost us anything necessarily. They don't cost us very much, I should say. You never know when one of these could turn into something. You know what? Why not? We'll approach to sign this guy. Put him out on loan for a season or so. Kind of just want to try and make use of the money we got off of Ash to try to make the rest of our team as good as it possibly can be. And part of that is picking up some of these these youngsters that, that could turn into some some pretty good players. Uh, definitely not. This guy doesn't start high enough to really justify, I don't think. It's a midfielder. Again, another one just doesn't really start high enough. Doesn't have enough potential either. All right, uh, Matthews was named to uh, Player of the Week. That's good to see. Attacking to balanced. I'm going to leave it on attacking. Um, last time we switched that, it, it didn't feel like it worked out as well as I would have liked. I think we want to remove getting stuck in. Cole is his favorites, although only even, so, you know, could be worse. I think we have a good chance. I think we have a chance on this in this game. To really, really show up and do what we need to do. It is an away, uh, away game for us, so that definitely makes it hard. And Hola is a um, is uh, in the Skybet League 1. So, in fact, I don't remember. Let me see exactly. Where is it? Oh. Uh, they're 6th in Skybet League 1. So they're pretty good. Uh, they're really, really good. We did win the last time we faced them, though. Now... What was the circumstances of that? I actually don't know. So it's hard to say what, what that actually means for us. Um, I think I'm going to put Gaffney up here. Just feel like a little bit faster player. I mean, I could go back to Yates. You know, we will go back to Yates. Yates is just a faster player. I feel like we need that faster player for this type of thing. Williams over here on the left-hand side. Um, Hardy over here on the right-hand side, who is currently red flag, so never mind. Uh, I guess we'll go... Could bring Tomlinson over, but I really want Tomlinson. No, you know what? We'll bring Tomlinson over. And that way we can bring Cool in the middle. Cool plays that position really well. Worthington here. Uh, a lot of guys with yellow cards. I mean, this is it is what it is. Worthington's a little tired, but honestly, what other option? Cool or Bird? I think we'll leave Worthington in there. He's going to be okay. Simple Kelleher. Unfortunately, Kerr is still injured. Nope, I think these are our best two players here. Reed, do we swap Reed out for Halliday? I think we want to try and win this game as best we can. Is Doyle still injured? What's it say for Doyle? Two days. Okay, well, we won't risk him then. We'll bring Ture back in here. Williams, Thompson. I think everybody else is looking okay. Obviously, Smith, I think, is going to be our better goalkeeper. I don't think Atkins is any better, is he? No, he's definitely not. He's just gray stars down here, so he's not even yellow starred. All right, we'll go with this. I think this looks pretty good. And um, how are we looking on the bench? I think the bench feels pretty good. Gaffney, both Gaffney and Rooney, I think, are going to be okay. A lot of guys have got injuries, though. All right, let's go with this. See what this team can do for us. Dressing room. Come on, guys. No, oh, they seem confused. That's not good. Pressure's off. Play your natural game. Okay, whatever. Go away. <laughs> that uh, made things worse. Uh, how do you think Matthew Worthington will react to the current media interest in his performance? Uh, I think he'll thrive. Whole city are all that stand between you and a place in the Check and Trade Trophy final. Just excited to are you by the possibility of winning the competition? Be fantastic. Absolutely. All right, hopefully I didn't demoralize guys, my guys too much and they mess up here in the early part of this game. We shall see. Kelleher kicking it pretty deep here in the early opening highlight here. Looks like that is just going to be the end of that highlight. And we'll see what happens here. Got a throw in here from us. To Holiday into Tomlinson. Tomlinson is going to get it all the way over to... Nobody, unfortunately. Uh, 
Hull was able to get in front of that one. In fact, they're going to be able to get possibly a shot off here. It looks like they are going to get a shot off. Good save by Smith. Good job, buddy. Glad we brought you in on loan to try and try and get us some, some, some good performance back there in the goal slot. Uh, kick in here. Uh, we already get in front of that one. Williams able to get his head on that one as well. Is he going to be able to run this one down? He is not. It's still going to be an attack from Hull here. Tries to get inside. It's going to be another corner kick to Hull. So, still more highlights for the whole team, unfortunately. McLeod here from Hull. Gets the corner across. Worthington able to get his head on that one. Williams also be able to get his head on that one as well. Again, only as far as the whole team. Uh, but it does look like that's the end of that highlight. We're going to get a free kick here from Keller. We've seen these go in the back of the net before. Log able to get his hands on that one, though. Keeping his head up. Not, not letting it get past him. Hull throwing the ball in. A couple other guys looking a little bit more fatigued than you would expect 10 minutes into the game. Maybe that plays to our advantage. Uh, Pittman over here on the left-hand side gets all the way across. Uh, Simple is able to get his head on that one. Matthews again getting his head on. Are we going to chase this one down? We are. Williams is going to chase that one down. He's going to be able to get it back to Ture. Ture up to Williams. Williams is going to kick it deep. Yates is in the area. He's able to collect that one. He's going to have a good chance at a shot here. Oh, good save by the, by the, the goalkeeper here, Long. That was a pretty good shot. Good save. Uh, we're going to get a corner kick here from Tomlinson. All the way across, our team is not in the area, unfortunately. And it looks like Hull is going to be able to run this one down pretty easily with no, no issues whatsoever. Good tackle there from Ture. Gets it out of the bounds. Gets our team able to set up more of on a defense side. Uh, and yeah, we're up to three shots, two on target. So, so far looking okay. Possession is in favor of Hull, however. Got something going on here. Got no booking. Kelleher, another chance here. Uh, off the wall, unfortunately. Deep kick here. Holiday was able to get in front of that one, though. And no further highlight there, unfortunately. Come on, guys. We're playing not terrible, to be honest. We're playing pretty good. Tomlinson picking up a yellow card, unfortunately. Worthington picking up a yellow card. Back-to-back -back yellow cards within a minute of each other is not a good thing to start with. Come on, guys. We're playing okay. We're playing well enough to get to steal this game. Right, throw in here from Ture. Ture gets it into Matthews. Matthews gets it back to Ture. Ture uh, over to Worthington. Worthington to Cole in the middle. Cole's going to get over to Matthews. Matthews tried to go for a goal. I mean, he kind of caught the goalkeeper sleeping a little bit, but it was about a foot, foot and a half wide, unfortunately. But you never know. Those can sometimes go in. I'm okay with that. Oh, come on, Yates. Get, oh, there we go. Worthington able to pick that one up. Tries to sneak it through. Unfortunately, I don't know if there was just miscommunication there, but uh, we were not able to get through there and pick that one up. Matthew's able to run this one down, though. Up to Williams. Williams going to get over to Cole. Cole going to get over to Halliday on the right-hand side. Halliday has some space here. Williams is in the... Oh, he has scored so many times from that spot. Uh, I thought that was a good chance of getting that one in. Nine shots, three on target. Just nothing, nothing going in the back of the net so far for us. Hull picking up yellow card. All of our midfielders have a yellow card at this point. Throw in here from Hull. Burke over to Danny. Danny up to McLeod. Back to Burke. Come on, guys. Cameron. Looks like they're kind of taking their time up. Oh, we're just waiting for the right time. Garvin was going for it. Thankfully, Halliday was able to run that one down. Simple. Kicking it up pretty deep. Unfortunately, none of our players are in the area. Doesn't look like we're going to be able to come up with that one. Another deep kick here. Uh, I think Halliday's going to be able to collect this one just fine. Hopefully he doesn't get it taken away from him. No, he doesn't. Up to uh, Tomlinson over here on the right-hand side. Tomlinson gets tripped up. He's able to get control of that one again, though. He's pushing it up pretty aggressively here. It's going to get up to Yates. Yates over to Matthews. Matthews is wide open. Yes! Matthews with his 15th goal of the season. Our best player of the season this year by far. Just outstanding play from him. Way to get us up. One goal, nothing. Right before halftime. That is what we need to see. 13 goal shots, four on target, one of them in the back of the net. Tomlinson able to get that takeaway. Uh, unfortunately, not a very good pass following up because Burke was able to take that one back. Just got a few sec, about a minute or so left in this half. Would really like to go into halftime up one nothing. That would be some really good momentum uh, to carry over into the second half. Long kicking it. Well, long. Um, are we going to be able to recover this? We are not. Garvin's able to pick that one up. Kicks it pretty deep. Burke is able to run that one down, though. Oh, that was so close to going into the back of the net. Thankfully, it did not. We should be getting the end of the halftime here soon. Come on, guys. Hold on a little bit longer here. There we go. There's halftime. Good play so far. Absolutely good play.
Please just how things are going. Keep it up, guys. Keep up the good work. Let's hold on for this victory, guys. This would be huge for our team. Get into the check of trade finals here. Deep kick here. Simple should be able to run this one down. Over to Smith. Smith up to uh, Worthington, maybe? Nope. Uh, free kick to us. Okay, that's good. Need to start swapping out our midfielders here soon just to keep them from uh, hopefully picking up a red card because that would be a very tur bad turn of events. Long kicking a deep kick here. Uh, Halliday is able to get his head on that one. Unfortunately, we were not able to get the recovery. Uh oh, Garvin able to get past our team. He's got what? I was going to say, he has a really good chance of here of putting that one in the back of the net. Ah, uh, come on, guys. I know we can play better than that. That was just, just letting him have that one, unfortunately. All right, free kick here from Kelleher up to Tomlinson. Tomlinson going to push it up a little bit. Got some decent space here. Tries to get up. Williams is in the area. Oh, excellent save by Long. Williams thought he had that one. He scored so many times from that spot. Um... Okay, I don't know what that... Never mind. We're good for now. We're about to do some swaps here in a moment. All right, long another with another kick here. Uh, are we able to recover this? We are not, unfortunately. Denny's able to run that one down up to I don't know how you say the name. Ints over to Denny. Denny. Denny's going to be able to get over to Bowen. Bowen back to Denny. Come on, guys, get this one, get this away from these guys. Pittman running this ball up. He's, thankfully, we we're able to get in front of that one. Unfortunately, Bowen's going to be able to run this one down. Over to Denny. Denny. This highlight is still going on. It's a scary highlight, guys. Come on. Don't like this highlight. Gavin. Garvin, I've already got a goal here. Over to Denny. Denny taking up the goal. Come on, guys. We've played so well so far. Come on. It's not too late. Let's get this back to a, a draw. All right. See what we got here. Uh, tactics. Cole just not playing well. I mean, Halliday's playing terrible. But I really don't want one of these guys to go off the field. I'm just going to hope that Halliday just can pick it up. But, so we're going to go ahead and swap out Cole instead. Maybe it's a mistake. I don't know. We'll bring in Bird for now. See what he can do up there. Got a throw in here from Halliday. It is a highlight for us. Worthington is going to be able to push it over to Bird. Bird, fresh legs. Over to Matthews. Matthews had a chance there. Unfortunately, just... Right in front of, you know, hit right into the guy in front of him. We're going to be able to recover this. We are not. Garvin is going to be able to push this one up. He's already got, been instrumental in one goal. Oh, good clear out there. I think he got the assist on the second. I can't remember. Uh, Garvin. Yeah, he did the assist. So Garvin playing outstanding so far today. Really got to be careful. We got 17 shots, five on target. Just can't get anything going in the back of the net. All right, we're going to go ahead and uh, do another sub here. I feel like we have to trade out Halliday here. Hopefully those other two guys just don't pick up anything. So how about Reed, get Reed in here? See if he can play better than Halliday's been playing. Halliday throwing the ball straight to the whole players because, you know, that's what you want to see. Smith running really deep up. Pushing it up to Kelleher. Kelleher over to Semple. Simple. trying to set up some sort of offensive attack here. Torre over to Williams. Williams not really making a good play there, unfortunately. Simple. Back to Ture, Ture, back to Simple, up to Worthington. Over to Bird, Bird, fresh legs. Deep left over to Ture. Ture has a chance to make a cross here. Uh, good tip by the goalkeeper. Thomas O'Neill, though, will pick that one back up. Another good tip away from the goalkeeper. It is going to be uh, a corner kick for us. We would really love to get a set piece goal here. That would really help things out a lot. Oh, trip. It is going to be a penalty. It is going to be a penalty. Do we want to change the player? No. We do want Worthington to take this one. Come on, Worthington. Come on, Worthington. Come on, Worthington. Get us even back up, buddy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, good goal. Evens us back up. Oh, that's good stuff. That is exactly what you want to see. Very, very good stuff, guys. Come on. Keep it up. Keep it up. We're playing... Very, very well. I mean, I'd be happy with the draw at this point. I don't know if this will go into penalties or if this will go into um, 
uh, extra time. I actually don't know. Or if it'll go into an extra game. It might be a, an extra game that we play. I actually haven't, don't remember the rules. Uh, go ahead and do that. I'm very tempted to bring Rooney on here. Because if we go into penalties, we would rather have Rooney on here than Yates. What is your penalty? Where is it? Penalties at 9. Very tempted to bring Rooney on here. It's not that Yates has been playing poorly. It's just Rooney's just so good at penalties. Okay. We're going to do it. We're going to bring Rooney on. I think it's the right move. I don't Again, I don't remember what how this game ends. Just in case it does end in penalties, I think this is the right move. Come on, guys. Come on. I'm okay with just holding on to this draw at this point. Looks like Trey might be getting a card here. Does pick up a yellow card. It's the first yellow card of the season. Just a couple more minutes to hold on to, guys. Tempted to bring it back down to more of a defensive thing, but honestly, I'd rather I'd rather take the win outright. Matthews with a kick over to Bird. Bird over to Worthington. Worthington is going to be able to get it back to uh, Bird. Bird over to Trey. Trey to Thomas on the left-hand side. He's got some space. Had a little bit of space. Williams is there. Back to Tomlinson. Tomlinson tries to get back to Williams. Unfortunately, nothing going there. Back to Reed, though. Got some time here. Up to Bird. Bird over to Matthews. Matthews to Rooney. Rooney gets tripped up. Oh, come on. That was a penalty, right? Not really. Uh, Garvin's going to be able to chase this one down. Unfortunately, this looks like this could very well be a goal here. Oh, able... <laughs> and that is... It's a sad way to end a really, really good game. Trey, Matthews, Matthews trying to get something going here. Not much time left. Williams, Williams pushing it up. Unfortunately, just nothing, nothing going well for us at the moment. This looks like this is the end of this game. Wow. It's a heartbreaker. Had a chance there. Just stolen away from us there at the very end. Man. Very heartbreaking game. I'll be honest. I thought we had a chance there. So it would have been penalty shots. Man. I don't know what to tell the team at that point. <sighs> I'll just say that that was a pleasing performance. Oh, so sad. I thought we had a chance to get into penalties. And I think we could have well, we have a we have a backup goalkeeper, so maybe maybe not. But man, that hurts. That hurts pretty bad. All right, well we're gonna go ahead and put a cut in there. Um, back to back losses, pretty painful, especially one point losses. I mean, this is just just not what you want to see. Our next game is against Stevenage. Um, Going to be a really, really tough game. Next game you guys will see probably be these two back-to-back -back home games here against Scunthorpe and Crawley. Um, and then probably Dag and Red and Bury. And then we won't, if we show anything else after Dag and Red and Bury, it would be if we make the playoffs or something like that. We'll see. We'll have to figure out the the uh, April timeline later. But for March, Scunthorpe and Crawley will be the next two games that you guys see. Hopefully we have a decent number of, of wins in here. Um, possibly even some draws. I'm okay with draws on some of these away games. We shall see. I do appreciate you watching. And I hope you join me again next time. Thank you and goodbye.